So the Canon M50 is out now with flip screen, 4K and all. And in this video, we're just gonna be doing a quick look at some test footage, including slow motion shot on this camera and 4K video. All of that's coming up right now. What's up, Sean here, and this is Think Media, bringing you the best tips and tools for building your influence with online video. And on this channel, we do a lot of tips and strategy videos, as well as tech gear reviews, just like this one. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. So we've been testing out the Canon M50 and so far I love this camera. And in this video, we're gonna be going through the footage shot in 30 frames a second in HD, 60 frames for some slow motion, the 4K footage, as well as the high frame rate, which allows 120 frames a second to do ultra slow motion at 4X speed. So let's kick it off with test number one, and that's just your standard 30 frames a second HD video. And we actually did a little test kind of using this in a vlogging setup. We had a Rode Pro mic on top of there. And one of the things I'm loving about the Canon M50 is the enhanced dual pixel autofocus. So you'll notice that the uh, focus stays really, really crispy. There's 99 autofocus points up to 100 and over 140, depending on what lens you're using. So it's really good at tracking faces, but I'd love to hear from you what you think about this footage. 30 frames a second, light, sun is definitely setting, and uh, we're just out here. I uh, got Kyle, got Omar, great camera. I mean, you can check it out right now. We got a wide angle lens on, and um, super great footage, nice and crispy. We have a Rode Pro mic, but we've also tested the onboard mic. All right, for the second test, we did 60 frames a second. So that allows for smoother motion, number one, but also allows for slow motion if you want to slow your footage down in editing. So check out this footage. Now this quick test that you're about to see was shot in 60 frames a second on this camera and the audio that you're hearing is also the onboard mic of the Canon M50. What is up guys, Sean here, 60 frames a second, Canon M50, lens IS, no IS on the camera, no electronic image stabilization. All right, now we're in full vlog mode. We've got some digital IS support. We're walking around. We're hanging out. We've got all kinds of different light like dynamics. You literally have got a Kyle Anderson. Look, I can track your face. You got an Omar right there. Look how small you look with this wide angle lens. Now, let's look at the 4K footage that we tested out with the Canon M50. Now, there's two downsides when it comes to shooting 4K with this camera. And the first is that you can only shoot up to 24 frames a second. So actually, this entire project is a 4K project set to 24 frames in Premiere and so that we could base it around the 4K footage shot with this. Not a huge deal breaker, but it is a limited frame rate. You can't really do slow motion or anything like that, or even 30p if you would want to. And then the second thing is that there is a crop factor on 4K, which means there's already a crop factor um, in video mode of 1.6, that's pretty standard for Canon cameras, meaning if you're shooting with a 15 millimeter lens, technically you need to multiply that by 1.6 and it'll zoom in a little bit in video mode, whereas in photo mode you get that full picture. That's called a crop factor. In 4K, it has an additional crop factor on top of the first one. So you'll notice in 1080, you have a pretty wide shot. In 4K, it actually crops in even more. So even though it's really cool that the M50 has 4K, it is kind of limited. But saying all that, let's still look at some of the footage and see how it looks. What is up guys, Sean here just vlogging right off the M50. This is the audio coming right off the M50, vlogging in 4K, face tracking happening, even though you don't have dual pixel, 
you've got you know still good contrast based autofocus so it's kind of uh, chasing my face around if we go into some poor light here we can see it up here we got a little bit of Kyle going we got a little bit of Omar going it looks like it lost the face but it is tracking the face is no problem the actual focus being on point could be the issue 24 frames a second right on camera I wonder if image stabilization's on the next thing we tested out was the high frame rate on the Canon M50. Now this allows you to do 4X slow motion at 720p and you just go into the menu, you select high frame rate and then you're good to go. Now the footage we thought looked super cool as we were at a skate park here in Vegas getting some cool shots. But the downside again is that resolution is limited. It's 720p so it's even smaller than traditional 1080p footage. But one thing that I think is cool about that is again, you wouldn't be getting this camera just for this feature, but it is a nice bonus feature and 720p is definitely usable for social media, Instagram stories, all over Facebook, even YouTube, potentially a little bit, but for other uses. So check out some of these clips. some of the footage from this camera. If you wanna actually check out our playlist with my full review, some of the other videos we did covering the Canon M50, we'll link that up on the YouTube card as well as post it in the YouTube description below. Question of the day, what do you think about all the footage that's coming out of the Canon M50 that you saw in this video and maybe that you saw somewhere else online? Let me know in the comments section below. Thanks for checking out this video. Subscribe and ring the bell if you haven't yet. And if you wanna see other videos in our Canon M50 series, just click or tap the screen right there. For another video from Think Media, click or tap the screen right there. Until next time, Think Media is bringing you the best tips and tools for building your influence with online video. Keep crushing it, and we will talk soon.